Yo, what's good with the YouTube? Welcome back to A1 Hoop Zone. Back at y'all, another one, man. But before we jump into this, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new. All right, let's let's get it, y'all. Let's get it. So first up, we got the Chicago Bulls versus the Washington Wizards. Uh, man, it's gonna be a tough tough one for the East, but nonetheless, let's dive right into this, man. So we'll start off with the Bulls. Um, Bulls gonna be short-handed again. Uh, looks like Zach Levine is still kind of recovering from his injury, so he's gonna be sitting out tonight's game. Um, obviously everybody know Lonzo, Lonzo ball still out. He's uh, recovering from his injury. I think he's going to probably miss the first month or so, of the, uh, if I'm not mistaken, of the regular season. So uh, I'm not going to be seeing him uh, anytime soon. Hopefully it goes by fast. He has a, a great uh, recovery and he's able to get back out there and we see him on the floor. Just because I like what he brings to the game and his energy, his passion about it, the way he plays the game. Uh, I do enjoy seeing him on the court, but nonetheless, um, the boys going to be shorthanded, uh, you know, so that means uh, obviously the role players are going to have to step up big. Uh, DeMar carried this team in their, in their first game to lead them to a one and no, uh, start, but they're going to need, they're going to need a lot out of Dragas. They're going to need a lot out of, of, um, of, uh, white. They're going to need a lot out of, uh, Alex Caruso, um, Drummond. So there, Vucevic, like they're going to need their supporting cast to step up and step up big. Um, why is that? Uh, just because it's obviously a one-man show against a bad team or, or just being able to eke out a win is good, but long-term wise, it's not good for building camaraderie and chemistry amongst the team. So um, this is, a, I would say, a, a opportunity for them to build upon that, man, that being able to to branch out and re rely on their role players and see what they have amongst the team as well. Because like I said, again, they're, they're all going to need to step up in order to have an opportunity um, to, to beat this Wizards team. Now let's switch over to the Wizards and why I say that. Um, I feel like this Wizards team is deeper. Um, I, you got Machiro or Machiro. I can't. I'm tripping on his name right now. Again, I'm going all based off memory here. Bradley Bill, Christoph Porzingis, Kyle Kuzma, uh, Will Barton, Monte Morris. I mean, this team is deep uh, with scorers, and, and they're a tough nose defense, just like the Bulls is. But except for, I think they have more firepower when it comes to scoring. Um, so it, it, I think uh, it, it's going to be tough sledding for them. Now, obviously, we all know. I think Bradley Bill can equal out, um, equal out if not score, probably more than DeMar DeRozan can, man. So, and we've seen DeMar put up some monster numbers in the past, but we've also seen Bradley Bill go off as well. Now, the thing is, Bradley Bill has his running mates with him. He got a healthy Porzingis, he got a healthy Kyle Kuzma, and like I just listed off the role players that can also put up points in a hurry as well, man. So, uh, it's going to be tough for the Bulls to overcome that. So, my pick for this game. Uh, I'm going to have to go with the Wizards. Um, a lot of people might say that's an upset or, 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 you know, they deem it as an upset, things of that nature. But I think this is one of those sleeper teams in the East, um, you know, that have, you have to keep your head on a swivel. Why is that? Because, like I said, Bradley Bill can ball with the best of them. And he has he has other players on this team that has proven they can get, get buckets in a hurry as well. I mean, I think they're looking to put it all together uh, this time around this season and, and see if they can – not, not only squeak their way into the playoffs, man, but get solidify them and make them a contender in the East. Uh, I think they're a piece, probably a piece or two away from that, but they, you know, they have the grit and soul to, to dig down deep and go for it. Um, so I'm picking, um, I'm picking the Wizards to win this game, man, straight up. I uh, don't have a point spare for this one I can give you all, but uh, if you can see, like I said, I'm trying something new. I'm sharing my prediction video. Um, the three and one right now, my Lakers are the ones that lost it for me yesterday, but uh that was a hard. That was a hard pick. If I was betting money on it, I would have picked the Clippers. Um, but that's I wasn't betting money on it. I was going off of a hard pick. I'm always probably rock with them off of a hard pick, man. But uh, for this game, I got the Wizards winning tonight. Uh, first game up um, for the for the start of uh, we have a number of games tonight, so we'll be dropping multiple videos on that. But I got the Wizards tonight to win this game um, versus the Bulls. But that's all I got for y'all, man. I appreciate you stopping through. Again, make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Uh, leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know what you think. Let me know who you think is going to win this game and things of that nature. And I'll be sure to respond to each and every one of y'all, man. Um, also, if you wish to support the channel, that information is flowing at the bottom of the screen. It'll also be in the description of the video. Uh, again, I appreciate you stopping through to the zone, and I'll catch you guys later, man. Appreciate it.